What's going on guys? Kai here at Golf Auto Direct in Wayland, Mississippi bringing you the 2012 Jeep Wrangler with 127k miles. Guys, you can see this vehicle's in immaculate condition. Um, we're going to go over the outsides of the vehicle, do a full walk around, and then get in the vehicle and just really showcase everything. So just starting off guys, we've got the full chrome rim set, extra large tires, beautiful immaculate deep red color on the outside this is the sahara wrangler unlimited so the trail edition this is a four-wheel drive vehicle um, it does have a privacy tint package on the vehicle meaning no tint in the front mid-grade tint in the middle and the highest grade uh, legal grade tint in the back we do have the stationary running boards on the vehicle here and you can see guys no blemishes no scratches no cracks uh, no paint chips or anything on the side the left hand side uh, well of the vehicle there are some minor minor cosmetic stuff here guys like looks like a little gouge someone had caught on a trail or something like that tires are in great condition tons of tread left on these on these tires uh no real uh eggs or anything in the vehicle we've got a full second uh fourth spare on the vehicle here um your toe jacks and everything there so open up the vehicle guys this is a one key vehicle um we do have an auto start feature on the vehicle here and um, it, all the buttons are in working condition. So we're just gonna open the back up here. You can revealing the tow hitch that we have down here. Um, we're gonna go ahead and lift this up as well. Really nice, clean interior here in the back. This is the Jeep mats directly from Jeep. Um, so no aftermarket mats placed in. Um, this is a hard top edition as well. So this can all be removed. Um, we do have a, an infinity speaker stereo set here in the back the, and throughout the entirety of the vehicle. Just gonna back up and close this down. Oh, we did that wrong. Glass first. I'm gonna close the bed here and just move around the right hand side of the vehicle. All the lights and all of um, the inner workings of the vehicle are in working condition as well. You can see here, guys, that um, it's the same song and dance on this side of the vehicle. No real major um, dents, cracks, or anything like that. Um, on top of that, the Carfax indicates that this vehicle's never been in any accidents, never had any major issues, uh, never had any um, major things replaced in the vehicle. So whoever had it definitely took care of it. I mean, you look at the condition in comparison to the mileage at 126K, guys, you know, generally these things would be junked up, especially a Jeep that's been ridden hard, you know, but um, runs and drives super smooth. Um, we do have aftermarket mats in the backs here. Um, a beautiful brown leather interior here with no cracks or, or brakes or anything. No discoloration in the seats. Um, no real wear and tear. It looks like there is a little spot here that just, just started to peel. Um, but other than that, guys, just a great, great condition. Uh, moving forward in the vehicle, it looks like we have a little scratch here. Um, not sure if that can be buffed out or not. And let's just go ahead and make the full wrap around on the vehicle. And here we are back to the front. Just to go ahead and show you guys. Um, we do have the dual LED and your full fog light set up. And it looks like a, a pull behind hitch uh, system has already been applied to this vehicle, guys. You can see that this thing is ready to be hooked up and towed. So... Let's go over some of the other things that I've noticed. So it looks like we have a, a crack in the windshield here that you can't really see, uh, but I'll point it out from the inside of the vehicle when we hop in. So let's go ahead and confirm those miles for you guys. So hopping into the vehicle again, guys, the door well is in a great condition. I understand that we are putting a um, seat covers in here just to um, preserve the, the interior of the vehicle. Um, it looks like there has been some pretty heavy cracking and fraying in the seat here, um, but not to a point that's too far gone. It doesn't seem like um, it's gotten down into the cushion. No, like big chunks have been ripped out. It just needs to. Um, it needs to have a detail a guy come and refurbish the leather here. Um, this can be patched, but until then, we're just gonna throw um, some seat covers on it and make sure it doesn't get any further. Um, other than that guys, I don't see any other damage besides the windshield. So let's go ahead and hop in We'll check that out. So you see there's a crack here that runs across the bottom a crack here that runs across the side And then a crack here, which is pretty common for these these off-road Jeeps guys, you know, so this is a manual Jeep um, You do have your two four low high settings here 
and um, this is not a push start vehicle so it's turnkey and let's confirm those miles bam there they are 126,683 AC's already blowing nice and cold guys we'll get that up and cranking I mean frosty it's very very first thing um, another thing I need to point out is I'm under, under the impression that we do have a sensor that needs to be replaced in the vehicle that we are having replaced um, so um, as that happens guys will communicate with whoever's interested in the vehicle but let's go over some of the features we have here so there is an inverter in the vehicle here guys we can turn on right here it allows us to use our uh, plug-in outlets um, wherever we need to throughout the vehicle um, we have our hazard lights obviously which are in work and um, condition our downhill assist which is a, a really nice feature it helps um, the gear locking brake a little heavier whenever you're going downhill our traction control and heated seats for both you and the passenger here's our um, our settings for our uh, our mirrors on the sides which are mechanical we do have a nice little stereo here which is in working condition so we'll go ahead and turn that off um, it doesn't look like we have any uh, major features, but we do have uh, some talk capabilities, probably some Bluetooth stuff, um, an aux cord here, a, a load, and uh, check that out. We've got some navigation, so we can check out the map and kind of bring us around wherever, which is um, probably a really um, not something that was generally offered in this year vehicle. I mean, it's a 2012 with navigation, guys. This was a, a top-of-the-line vehicle when we got it. So we do have a lock on our center console here, a nice little deep well center console, and there's our 115-watt, uh, 115 115-volt, 115 uh, 150 150-watt outlet there. And then we have a 120 120 120-volt outlet right here in the center here. If you guys have anything you want to hook up there, get out here into the center console we do have the original owner manual um, still has the the hardback copy um, of the um, uh, bag there as well this is the hard top again guys so all of this can be removed we can take this entire top off um, and you guys can roll around without it there um, so again guys this is kite golf auto direct in waveland mississippi bringing you the 2012 uh, jeep wrangler um, with 126k miles um, here in the the center console or on the steering wheel here we have a hands-free talk to text on the left um, and then we have our, our cruise control here on the right so uh, guys just uh, my personal preference is a beautiful beautiful vehicle um, no brace of smells um, runs and drives fantastic starts right up every single time no major issues um, other than what looks like to be some some cosmetic things just this this spot here in the seat in the windshield which um with interest we can kind of work out and get some of those things taken care of and we're already in the process of getting those things and things taken care of so if you guys have any questions or concerns you can reach out to me here at golf auto direct in waveland mississippi um, or if we're already communicating you can just text me back in the text thread guys if you feel like there's anything that i missed please give me a call i'd be happy to come back out here and touch more on these amazing vehicles and and find out any more information that i can to help uh, but i look forward to meeting all of you and earning your business and i look and i, I will talk to you soon all right Bye-bye.